It certainly won't look like normal. Instead of 100,000 people packing in for the air show, about 1,000 cars went or through this gate and parked near the runway. It's not perfect, but officials here say just being able to do something is a thrill. Four months ago, we weren't sure whether we were going to have this. Gabe Monzo is the director of the Arnold Palmer Regional Airport. Getting a plan together for the return of the Westmoreland County Air Show was no easy task. A few months back, the airport decided to shift to a drive-in model. Cars will line up along the runway where people can get out and sit in chairs. Despite a lot of COVID-19 restrictions being lifted, the air show will move forward with just 1,000 cars per day. Monzo saying it was too late to make any more changes. And most importantly, he says he's just happy to be back. And because of that, part of the show will include a flyover throughout Westmoreland County. A chance to say thank you to everyone that did their part to get through the pandemic. Primarily for us to say thank you. You know, um, <clears throat> there were a lot of people that did a lot of stuff. And we all went through quite the turmoil and trouble and everybody did. Everybody, everybody had something to do with it. Now there are still some tickets available at select shop and save locations. We've also posted more information about what drivers need to know on the WTAE mobile app.